Love Victor is one of Hulu's most popular original TV series. The show follows the journey of Victor as he comes out as gay and tries to navigate his sexual identity throughout high school. Of course, comes along all of the high school drama. The show was ranked as the number one most watched drama on Hulu when season one premiered. It was quickly renewed for a second season, which premiered during Pride Month this year. I had the opportunity to have a quick chat with Isabella Ferreira, who plays the sister of Victor, Pilar Salazar. Take a look. So, Isabella, so nice to chat with you here today about Love, Victor, season two. I just kind of want to start off by talking about, like, you know, season one was pretty wild, had a lot of very interesting scenes. How did you feel about coming back and shooting season two? I was just really excited, you know, I love the cast, we're basically like a family and I love all the stories that are being told um, on the show. So I was just, I was just extremely excited. We were filming during like, like the pandemic though. So it was a little weird, um, but we, we got through it and we figured it out. So um, I'm just happy that it's out now. Isn't it so wild though, that like season one was shot, like you can say definitely normal and then you come into season two and now it's like this pandemic and you have to adjust to all of that. Yeah, it was definitely it was definitely crazy. I mean, we had to get tested about three to four times a day, um, I mean, not a day, a week. <laughs> and we had to like wear masks and face shields, um, all understandable. We had to quarantine and stuff just to stay protected. But I'm glad we got it done. So now, you know, season two, obviously Victor's parents, the school, everybody knows about Victor's secret, essentially. The story has definitely progressed, has come a long way. What were your initial thoughts when you first read the script for season two and essentially how it all came out? I think I was just like, whoa, like what is going on? Because they give us the scripts little by little. And so like each time it was just more and, and more of a surprise because there was just new storylines coming out, um, especially with my character and like her love life and her new friends. It was just all kind of crazy. And I feel like I didn't expect it really, but I'm glad everything turned out the way that it did. And it was just, it was really nice to read. Well, I'm so glad that you mentioned, you know, Pilar's, you know, new, I guess you can say new focus on the show. You know, she has more friends now. She has these love interests. And without, you know, giving spoilers to the people, uh, how did you feel about all of the new stuff that you got to do in this season? I mean, everything was just was just so fun to do because I get to work with such amazing actors like my new my new friend in the show, Anthony K. Vaughn. He's such an amazing actor. He's so funny. He's literally just like his character. So it was always a ball to work with him. And then also Anthony Terpel. Yes, there's two Anthonys. Um, he's also amazing. And, and he, he plays like the love interest, I guess, for season two. And it's just it was just great. It was it was it was a lot of fun. So, yeah. <laughs> Isabella, I'm curious too, because, you know, obviously Love Victor, like I mentioned earlier, got a lot of praise from people, obviously, you know, more eyeballs on you as an actress and all of that. I kind of want to know how has your life changed, you know, since taking part in the series Love Victor? My life has changed drastically. I mean, it's kind of insane because I kind of went from being this like, you know, random girl from Philadelphia to being a girl on a show that has impacted I feel like so many people's lives and I get messages all the day every day on my social media of just like people saying how, how this has impacted their lives and it's kind of it's kind of crazy to think about because it's like wow this many people like saw my face and saw these stories being told and and loved it because I mean it, it's good I, I feel proud really I think <laughs> has it been surprising to you like everybody that has reached out yeah, I, I think when like when season one dropped, it was kind of overwhelming because, again, social media is such a big part in like the world today and seeing like followers just grow from like what 2000 followers or something to like 80K is, is kind of insane. And it, it it's kind of like scary because you're like, oh, my God, like, I don't know. I don't know how to handle all of this, but um, everyone's so lovely and our fans are so supportive. So um, that's great. That is really cool. And I love that. I love to see like your growth and just like everything that has come about this. So, you know, we have one last, well, we have a couple minutes left. So just really quickly, I kind of want to know, uh, you know, hey, if there's going to be, obviously, if there is a season three, what do you want to get out of Pilar? What are your hopes? I hope that she just continues to grow and to mature because season two, she definitely matured a lot, but I feel like she still has learning to do and stuff. Um, and I hope that, you know, I want to see where her love interest, her love life goes and, you know, if she gets more friends and stuff. So um, I don't know. We'll just see. We'll see what happens. 
Awesome. Congratulations, Isabella. And thank you so much for chatting with me here today. Thank you. I appreciate it. It was nice talking to you. Thank you. You can catch both seasons of Love, Victor right now on Hulu. If you enjoyed these interviews, make sure to give this video a like and subscribe to my channel for more pop culture content.